Welcome back everyone. I'll go ahead and show you exactly how to split screen multitask on any iPad Air 4. Now this is a very easy process. It doesn't really require any too crazy resources. You have everything at your disposal already. So what you need to do first is you want to find out which specific apps you want to split screen multitask. Not every single app is capable. A lot of games are not capable. A lot of, you know, video editing apps are not capable either. So keep that in mind. But if you're trying to multitask like the App Store and Safari or basic things like that, or let's say you're trying to keep notes and have the internet browser on the other side well you can do that and it's a very easy process so what you want to do first is put the specific apps that you want into this little bar down here which is your dock basically now if you open up an app sometimes it's in recent so you can just keep it there but let's say you don't see the app here you can go ahead and just drag that specific app let's say it's the app store and just drag it down into the dock and keep it there in this case i'll go ahead and keep it up here since it's already in the dock but once you have that app in the dock, you want to load up another app that may actually already be suitable. So in this case, I have this specific app Safari browser open. So what we can do here is pretty much, you don't want to grab the little toggle down here, which is a little thing. You want to swipe up from the bottom a little bit until you can see the dock. Now, once you see the dock, you want to drag an app that is compatible into split screen multitask by grabbing the app just like this. And you'll see that it comes out and it already becomes a little weird like that. And you want to put it to the side like this. And you will see that it will go ahead and open the app in another panel on the side. And you're pretty much already done. This is it. All you have to do now is pretty much use the app however you want to on this side. And you can use this app however you want to on this side. And that's really pretty much the process. As you can see, we have a full on Safari browser. We have a full on, you know, internet browser on this or the app store on the other side. Now let's say you want to go ahead and change these things around. Well, all we need to do is go ahead and drag this to the side and we can make our app store bigger. We can make our Safari browser smaller and vice versa. And it also works in landscape mode too. So if you want to make it, you know, this way, you have that option here too. And that's really pretty much the process. It doesn't really require anything more crazier than that. Very easy process. You know, if you guys run into any problems or anything, I'd recommend updating your iOS or iPadOS. That's typically what fixes it. But if you guys have any other questions or concerns, let me know in the comment section as well. Hit the like button. That would mean so much. But definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count. So it means so much if you guys can hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my other channels. More importantly than everything else, every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.